What's up, guys? Um, do that real quick. Um, this is Tournament 10, Episode 4. Now, seven competitors were able to get to Stage um, 2. A tie for the second most ever. The current most ever is 8, which is set in Tournament 5. Um, three out of the seven competitors um, are getting fast forward in and then the other four runs will be shown so I wanted to just start off and get through the fast for the people that are, will be fast forwarded first so we're gonna start with butt juice who um, failed the third obstacle cannonball alley then it was talking king is poop who cleared stage two with less than um with a little, no, not a little bit over a second, about one and a half seconds left. And finally, on um, the final fast forward, is Cry Myself to Sleep, who had the final obstacle, the triple reverse. So now we're going to head in to the actual runs. And here we go. The first runner on stage two is Talking King SS1. There's six obstacles. He'll have one minute and 32 seconds to complete it because these obstacles take a long time. First obstacle, Chain Reaction, and he's beaten it. And now on to the Salmon Ladder Try. We have the double Salmon Ladder where you'd go up one Salmon Ladder and transition to a second. This one, you go up one, transition to a second, go up that one, and then transition to a third, and then climb up that one. You have to do it very quickly because... It will eat up time, and now he's up, and now you have to drop down onto the Cannonball Alley, and this is what took Butt Juice out. Three Cannonballs, got to get to the other side, and he's done it, and now the new Spider Walk, these jumps, you don't have a lot, of, the first three jumps are normal, but then that fourth one, look, you don't have a lot of room to land on. And then this one is also very skinny, and so is that. And this one's just a tiny block, and then the last one is actually a pole. Barely any room. And now, on to the roulette row. He's got 25 seconds left. Gotta pick up the pace, down to 20 seconds. Fifteen seconds. Ten seconds left. Will he make it? It's going to be close. Five, four, three, two, and a clear with 1.97 seconds left. Talking's moving on to stage three. And next up, Atlantic Champ. He was able to get past stage two last tournament. Can he do it this time? Remember, one minute, 32 seconds. And he's past the chain reaction. Now onto the salmon ladder try. One slip up can cause you to fall the whole way down the salmon ladder. And if that happens, you're basically screwed because you will not have enough time to get back up that thing and clear. The two clears that we've had so far, the people have had just over a second left on the clock, so you cannot afford any mistakes here on stage two. And now on to the Cannonball Alley. He's got 55 seconds left on the clock. So he needs to pick up the pace here. Twenty five seconds is around the pace that talking had. But he goes through quicker. But he has said that he takes longer on this obstacle. I believe that was him that said it. Fifteen seconds. Ten seconds. And that is oh, I was looking at the clock wrong. That was someone else's time. He cleared with only with a little bit less than one second left. And here we go. 
Next competitor, DHD Fireball. Once again, he beat stage two last tournament. I'll have a minute and 32 seconds. And he's done it. Oh no, but that slope up. That can cause valuable time right there. That was like half of a second and he wasted. And now he's up the second. Same and ladder. Gotta get up the third. Oh, and look, more save jumps there. That's just eating up valuable time. He's up now, has to fly through Cannonball Alley. He needs to save time. He's down to 50 seconds. He might not have enough time on the clock. He needs to go. 40 seconds. Wait, no, sorry, 30 seconds. He needs to move 20. Mm, it's going to be close. He's down to 15 seconds left on the clock. 10 seconds. Four, three, two, one. Mm. That was very iffy. We're going to have to go check the footage. After further review, we have determined that DHD Fireball was able to clear with three one hundredths of a second left. So, very close. Only three one hundredths of a second. And now it's time for our final runner on stage two. This is the Sacred Pickle. So far we have three clears out of... What? What? Okay. Well, so far we have three clears out of the first six that have run the course. So three clears, three failures. And it's all up to him. Will there be more fails or more successes on stage two? And he's past the chain reaction. And moving through the first half of this. First little bit of the salmon ladder nicely. Transition. Oh, tried to skip around there. Didn't make it. Oh, spring jump. Nice. This guy appears to know what he's doing. And he's up the salmon ladder now, Cannonball Alley. He's got great time left. Still got 50, sorry, not 50, 60 seconds left on the clock. And now the spider walk. Oh no! He's out, just rushed it. And I also just realized I said we had three clears, we have four. The people moving on to stage three are Talking King SS1, Talking King as Poop, who was fast forwarded, Atlantic Champ, and finally DHD Fireball. We will see those four take on the third stage in the next episode, which will be the final episode. Does any of them have what it takes to go? past the third stage, and potentially even win. We'll find out in the next episode.